Ten Ton Skeleton by Royal Blood. I know this is a bass song, but I'm teaching it on guitar today. So the song is in D standard tuning. So we have D, G, C, F, A, and D. So the opening riff goes like this. So we are playing on the bottom string here and then the G string. So we're going to play open bottom string, 9 on the G, open bottom string, 7 on the G, open bottom string, 11 on the G, open and then 7 to 9. So that last bit again is hammer 7 to 9 on the G. So open 9, open 7, open 11, open 13, sorry 7 to 9. So play that through twice. Then we're going to play 8 on the bottom string, 9 on the G, 8 on the E, 7 on the G, 8 on the E, 11 on the G, 8 on the E, 7, 9, hammer on again. So that part. And then the last bit of the riff, open A, 9 on the G, open A, 7, open A, 11, open A, 7 to 9. So slowly together, and again. Eight, open A. Then we have this riff. So we're going to, because we've just come from up here. So you can either slide from this note, or you can slide from this note. So that's 12 of the bottom E string, or 7 of the A string. So then we're going to hit. We're going to slide from the 1st fret of the A up to the 7th fret. Then we're going to hit the bottom string, and then slide again, bottom string, and again. Then we're going to hit open bottom string and slide up to the 8th on the bottom string. And do that twice. Then we're going to hit open bottom string and slide up to the 5th. Open bottom string. 3, 2. So again. Okay, and that's 7 on the A string. Then, which is eight on the bottom E string, five, open again, three, two. Then we're back in two. That riff there. Then we're back in two. Then we have two notes sustained. One is on the eighth fret of the E string. And then the other one is the fifth on the E string. 
Then we're back into this riff. <laughs> etc. Then at the end of that time round we have So we're picking there on the third fret of the A string and then the second fret of the A string. Then we have some more sustained notes. So we're going to play 9 on the E string. 5 open and that's all on the bottom E string then we're going to play 9 twice on the 8th fret then we're going to hit the 12th fret and slide back so again that's 9 5 open 9 8, 12. Then we have this riff again, but it's slightly different this time, so. So that is the same as normal. Then, 8th fret, same as normal. Then we're going to play the open A part. So, on the open A part, open A. 9 on the G, open A, 7 on the G, then onto the D string, we're going to play 7, 9, 7, 10 on the A, 7 on the D, and then 7 on the A. So slowly. And one more time, 7, 9, 7 on the D. 10 on the A, 7 on the D, and 7 on the A. Then the riff changes slightly too. So the way we play that, open bottom E, then we're going to play 15 on the G with a little bend, open bottom E, 14 on the G with a little bend, Open bottom E, 12 on the G with a little bend. Open bottom E, 7, 9 on the G. So I'll do that again slowly. I'm not going to keep saying open because you know I'm playing that open every time. So it's 15, 14, 12, 7, 9. And then when it comes back in with the C here, it plays the same as normal. So there's no change there. That's just the normal part of the riff. Then we finish the song with picking out on the third fret of the A to the second fret of the A. Play that three times. Then we're going to play three on the A, down to uh, two on the E, and then the song finishes on. So again, that's three, two, three, two, three, two. Then we're going to play open bottom E, nine on the G, but open bottom E. 7 to 9 on the G, hammer on, and then slide from the 7th fret of the A off, and that's the end of the song. So. Play that three times, then. And that is the end of the tune.